Tonight, Lexington's new equity and implementation officer, Tiffany Brown, is sharing her plans to address racial and equality shortcomings in the city. Brown will be implementing recommendations made by the Commission for Racial Justice and Equality, a group organized by Mayor Linda Gorton, to identify and dismantle systemic racism in Lexington. As Chad Hedrick explains, Brown says she's ready to get to work and make change, not just talk about it. Tiffany Brown is a Lexington native. She says she's ready to roll up her sleeves to address equity shortfalls that the city has been working for more than a year to solve. Right out of the gate, I think all of the issues, uh, whether they be education, economic, health, law enforcement, justice, they're all very important issues. During nightly protests in July 2020, Lexington Mayor Linda Gordon announced the plans to develop the Commission for Racial Justice and Equality. Brown's job will be to oversee the more than 50 recommendations the initial commission reported in October 2020. A motto that I have is that we move from protest to policy. Everyone can't protest, um, but I believe that it's it's the mayor, um, it's her intention to create policy around um, Lexington becoming more equitable. For six years, Brown served in a similar role in Cincinnati, problem solving around crime safety and quality of life. Her work addressing gun violence won an award from the Ohio Crime Prevention Association for community engagement. That's what I feel that Lexington um, misses a lot, is the engagement with the community around the recommendations, around initiatives, around programs that are developed in the city, developed in local government. For Brown, bettering the quality of life is a priority and plans to focus on food insecurity, which was a health disparity recommendation. I love Lexington and Lexington will always be home. But it took me getting away to be exposed to another way of life, a different way of thinking. It exposed me to innovation and to bring that back and expose the community to that, to the possibilities of um, how to make change. A change, Brown says, takes a group effort. I alone am not the answer. Um, we have to do this together. In Lexington, Chad Hedrick for the Fox 56, 10 o'clock news. Brown says she's been meeting with organizations, community members, and people who were on the initial commission for racial justice and equality. The city is working on building a permanent commission, which Brown says could be announced early next month.